Hello guys and welcome back to episode 39 of Let's Play Oblivion. I uh, gotta get my timer going. Okay, let's continue on with the Dark Brotherhood quest. Ah, next to Kin. We have to come up here to Apple Watch over by Bruma. in the field no she must be inside hey lady oh hello there I'm sorry you startled me my nerves get rattled rather easily these days I'm afraid living alone will do that to you now is there something I can help you with I'm looking for your children. My children? Whatever for? Oh, oh dear. <laughs> Excuse an old woman's stupidity. You're here to pick up my gift list. Using your gift service was the smartest thing I've ever done. My children are spread across Cyrodiil, and it's so hard to shop for them all. So here's the list of all my precious little ones, though I dare say they're not so little anymore. <laughs> They grow up so fast, I swear. You'll notice that the list gives each child's location and some suggestions for gifts. Oh, and here's the gold I'm supposed to give you. Now please go. Those children are so dear to me, and I'd really like you to get them something special. Thanks again. <laughs> yeah. One Draconis member down. Or should I say two because I killed Jake the dog as well. <laughs> Let's loot the house. There we go. Ah. I'm not expecting much from this house. <laughs> okay. Well, there wasn't anything I wanted. Oh, I pushed the wrong button. I wonder, now that you're dead. Oh, good. Let's level up real quick. <laughs> of course, let's max out our speed. <laughs> okay, so let's read this list. Okay. Dear Courier, I would like to thank you again for agreeing to assist me. I was so delighted when a friend recommended you and will certainly employ your services again in the future if everything goes well with this round of purchases. You can imagine how difficult it is for an old woman such as myself to get around. My children, darlings, that they are, deserve the best, and I'm afraid I haven't been able to properly show my love and appreciation for them in quite a few years. But all that is behind me now. Here's the list of gifts I think my family would most enjoy, as well as each child's location, place, uh, as each child's current place of residence. 
which should be used for delivery. Matthias, Talos Plaza, Plaza District, Imperial City. He has a home there. Uh, Matthias always was a rough and tumble lad. The last I'd heard, he'd fallen in with some pretty tough characters there in the Imperial City. I'd feel so much better if I knew he was well protected. So I'd like you to find him a nice curious. Nothing too light. Iron or steel should be fine. And, if possible, I'd like it engraved with, To my dear Maddie, I'll always be there to protect you. Love, Mum. Andrus, the, drunk, uh, the drunken dragon inn. He owns the place and lives there as well. Andy has been brewing his own beer and spirits since he was six years old. The opening of that inn was the happiest day of his life. I'd like for you to get him some new tavern glasses. I'm sure there are craftsmen in the Imperial City who could make a fancy set from, fro from f Frosted Ebony or Altamer Crystal. Sibylla, Muck, uh, Muck Valley Cavern. Yes, my daughter lives in a cave, and no, I'm not very happy about it. Sibby has always loved animals almost as much as Andy loves beer. And a couple of years ago, she apparently thought it was a good idea to abandon the Empire and live as a savage with the rest of the animals. In that time, I'm afraid Sibby has kind of cracked. She's basically as wild as the beast she lives with. What can I do? I'm Sibby's mom mother, and I'll always love her. She's obviously, yeah, she obviously doesn't want or need anything from civilized society. So what I'd like you to do is find a tanner and secure the largest fur blanket you can possibly find. The last time I saw uh, Sibby was nearly naked, and I can't imagine there's much in that cave to keep her warm. When you do bring them to Muck Valley Cavern, be careful. Wild animals are bad enough, but Sibby herself will probably attack anyone on sight. Kelia, Castle Leowin. You'll find her in the barracks. My beautiful, my beautiful Kay, my dearest daughter, broke so many hearts when she was younger. But now that she is an officer in the Imperial Legion, I'm afraid she let herself go a bit. Not gotten fat, but Mafala, not that. <laughs> By Mafala, not that. But she settled into more practical kind of look. Even a bit boyish. I guess you could say so. What I'd like you to do is get my K as many pretty girl stuff as you can. Flowers, perfume, nor chocolate, that sort of thing. You've already received half of your fee in advance and will receive the remainder after the gifts have been purchased and delivered. As we originally agreed, thank you for providing such a valuable service. Sincerely, Perennia Draconis. Okay, so we know the locations now. So, I guess we're taking care of the Muck Valley Cavern one first. This is by far the easiest one to do. The one in Leowin is the hardest one to do. Well, that was unfortunate. He was facing the cave entrance as we walked in. Uh, 
Yay, you gave me my arrow back. Is that all that's in this cave? Ah, uh, that one didn't give me my arrow back. Nope. Oh. Yeah, it's stuck. Yay. Are you gonna give me my arrow? No. <laughs> what else is here? Boom, got him. Oh, hello there. Goodbye there. <laughs> ah, there's another bear. And he's done. Take that. Uh, let's see. Is there anything else here of value? Not that I can see. I guess now we just leave and head to the next target. Okay, so the next target is... Ah... What was his name? Andras. You have my ear, citizen. Hey. Looking for a room? Your mother bled like a pig. My mother? Yes. No! What have you done to her? I'll kill you! Try ah! it. Try it. Come at me, Imperial. <laughs> the next one is Matthias. Damn. That freaking beggar. Stop me from getting that one. Mm. 
Now nah, who's freaking detecting me? Sir, I got nothing to eat. Oh my god. One person after another keeps walking by. <laughs> okay, we're gonna have to quick save it before we do this. Okay, I did not incur a bounty. Wait till he leaves the house. <laughs> All right, I'm done. Looks like you're handy with a blade. Yeah? What do you look? Okay. Well then, I'm going to go about my business. Ah, uh, he went the opposite way. <laughs> we succeeded. It's all over. I'm going to. Just where I can loot. <laughs> my, get my arrow back. Grab this, grab this, grab this. It's all over, There we go. Now I can do that. And then I can just That's pay the bad. gold. Okay. And then I gotta come back in here and get the stuff they confiscated. Yay. That's another one down. Ah, oh, crap. The, mo the more difficult one. <laughs> Wait, did I actually succeed in that without inquiring about it? <laughs> ah, no. It's an auto give.
Okay, so there's one in Skingrad. It's all over. Then pay. That was unfortunate. Okay, we finished the, the Draconis family one. It's just unfortunate that that guard decided to show up right then. Okay, we're going to Deep Scorn Hollow. And we're going to start storing stuff there. Your service, ma'am. Go back out. Yes, master. Wait a minute. Let me think. Here. So there's that. There's the cells with the priest. Uh, I think it's... Yeah, that might be it. Yeah, it was. Here. Weapons. Store that. Store that. Store them. And that. Okay, and my ingredients and potions and stuff can go in here. Now we got a whole bunch more room to work with. Oh, wait, that was the wrong way. Okay, I don't got anything that's marked as stolen, right? Okay, we should be good.
we're immediately going to Castle Bruma. That way we can just turn in this contract. Or turn in the contract. Hey. Stop right there. Yeah, I want to. I want to uh, pay. Here's the proceed. Yeah, I shouldn't have to go in there now. Now let's continue on with this. And it should be this one. Yeah. Well, it wasn't that difficult. And he should be down here. There we go. Okay, I did not incur a bounty. Now, head to my next dead drop. Old Bridge. Reward and next contract. I picked up my next contract from the dead drop beneath the old bridge. I have been ordered to kill an Argonian hunter named Shaliz, who is holded up in the flooded mine. She is a wanted psychopath, so I should be cautious. Accidentally hit the auto run button. Ah, broke my. Okay. Ah. She had something of disintegration on. Okay, so that's done. We will have to go repair after this because that happened. So go to Breville and repair our stuff real quick. And then we'll pick up the next dead drop. Only asking for a single coin. I don't know what that was. Can I repair at the Fighters Guild? Or do I have to be a member to repair?
Hi. Hey. We're looking for. Oh. Good day. Okay, I gotta be a member. I remember a member. <clears throat> I should be able to repair at this shop over here. Greetings. Hey. The Archer's Paradox. Because... Yes. Let me take a look at what... Yeah, why didn't I just hit repair all? There we go. Uh, Good day. Have a look at my wares. I'm also I'm going sure to sell while I'm here. You. Yeah, I'll sell that. And this. I appreciate. Uh, what are the finest goods are and lowest selling? prices in all Cyrodiil? Mm hmm. Okay. That's all I needed. Be seen. Now, as for the dead drop. Oh, Fort Redman. It's a mud crab. I thought it was something coming out of the fort. <laughs> okay, and it should be in here. Okay, and with that, I'll end this episode here, and I'll see you in the next one, guys. Bye.